So yes, we're back in the shaft today. Let's finish up the intake piping. So here I have the MAF adapter with the gasket and the bolts. Also, I got a black L filter that is gonna go there. Most likely, I might have just to cut maybe the pipe a little bit more to fit it in. We have Jose working on the MAF sensor. So, he's tightening the bolts for the adapter. Right guys, so I already pull all the bolts. Again, do not over tire them because you can crack the intake adapter like I did over here. So here I have the new L filter, which I like. Nothing fancy, it's just like a cheap Spectre version from eBay. Just got it black because I think it's gonna look nice. So this one is gonna come in here like that. And after adjusting the hose clamp, this one will be over here. For now, as you guys can see, I will need just to short this pipe just to make sure everything fits here, which is gonna be challenging. So let me figure this out and then I'll let you know. So I removed the pipe in here just to try to fit it in, but Manny has a broken air filter right now, so I decided just to give that one to him. Here's the old one that he had. It's a low life over here. A M L filter. So now he has that one that's gonna go in. 3.5 intake. So so there it is. So for now what I'm gonna do I'm gonna try to find the best way to route this pipe in again. And what is messing me up a little is that I have this hose over here which comes from the blow valve into this piping over here or that connects before the turbo. So if this hose won't be here, it will be easy just to it will allow me to play better with the piping. Right now I have it loose and I'm trying to find the best way just to route it. But I have that hose in there, I have the fuse box here and it's giving me a hard time. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try to route it the best way as possible and leave the math here with the play ready. I'm gonna just buy another oil filter for now, but I'm gonna buy a mushroom. I'm gonna buy a mushroom style like the Sentra has. So I end up stopping by a Pans Auto and I grab this filter over here. So here is the new L filter. It's got a short one and it's gray, so for the feature it will match when I decide to change the color on the both cover or anything. So you guys can see it's a short one, so it should fit there perfectly. So let me uh, put it on and then I show you how it looks. So you have it guys, so <laughs> it's a nice gray small enough to fit there everything is connected the way you should so i'm very happy with that so yeah guys there you guys have it i finished what i started two weeks ago so now the turbo has the air filter and everything is done don't forget to check out my facebook page and my instagram page as well don't forget to like this video and share with your friends. Thank you again, and you guys have a nice day.